In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add load combinations for your net analytical model in Revit. This model will be sent to Robot in order to be analyzed with the uh, software that Robot provides. Before that, though, we need to make sure we had load combinations. The idea with load combinations underneath the Analyze tab and sitting here is the idea that you have a dead load or a live load and wind loads and in different con conditions those will be added together in the code in different ways. So you will sometimes in, in the code it will tell you to consider the dead load and the live load together. Sometimes it will ask you to look at the wind load and the uh, <clears throat> seismic load. Different combinations there. Once those are all put in you look for the worst case scenario and basically that is what governs the design. So in order to do that you can see we've got a uh, live load here and a wind load. Uh, just to show you how to build out uh, load combinations. Uh, you'll click on the load combinations and it will hit up on top. This is our first load combination. Uh, and you can name that. Uh, this one will just be a new combination. Once it's inputted here, then we add loads down to the lower right here. I'll add two items here. And you can see that the formula uh, changes based on as these come in. Now, we would want to change this one to live load and this one to wind load. So this would be an option just to consider both of those together. And you can change based off of the coding what each of these would be represented as. So you can change those to be represented this way. And again, that change, it, that change is reflected in the, uh, in the formula up here. Now, once that's done, you'll click OK. There's no visual change to the model, nothing that's seen. But underneath, uh, this is what's preparing it to when we go into the analysis. You can analyze this structure for deflection just based off light load or just based off wind, uh, wind load. But now that you've put in the combination, you can also analyze it based off of both those together in that specific combination. And we'll talk next about how to transfer that model over.